and welcome to a new exciting video from Wondershare Dr. Phone. This is your host Francisco and today in this video we're going to understand how you can fix an iPhone 15 that's stuck during data transfer. So with the release of the new iPhone 15 many users are now shifting to the latest device to enjoy new features. However, it has been reported by some users that their iPhone 15 is just getting stuck during the data transfer process. So in such a situation, transferring data can become a hectic process. Thus, to fix this iPhone 15 stuck issue, we have mentioned some reliable methods in this video. But before moving towards the central part, do make sure to subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon to stay up to date about new tech and iPhone related videos. Now let's go ahead and dive right in. So what are some of the problems behind iPhone 15 stuck on data transfer? The first thing that we all need to follow before encountering any problem is really identifying its root causes. So knowing the main reason why a specific problem is occurring in the iPhone 15 can help you choose a reliable solution accordingly. So let's go ahead and understand what are some of the issues behind the iPhone 15 that's stuck during the data transfer. Number one can just be bugs in the Move to iOS app. So if you're using the Move to iOS app for transferring data to your new iPhone 15, then there is a possibility that the application is outdated and has some bugs. Due to these bugs, your iPhone 15 can get stuck while your essential data is being transferred between two iOS devices. iTunes slash Finder backup is corrupted. So many users take help from iTunes slash Finder to create a backup of their old devices and restore it on the new iPhone. Therefore, if the backup created on this software is corrupted, then they can cause your iPhone 15 to get stuck on the data transferring process. Poor Wi-Fi connection. For transferring data between iOS devices with the help of iCloud, having a stable internet connection is very important. This means that if your new iPhone 15 doesn't have a stable Wi-Fi connection, data transfer from iCloud can actually slow down or just get stuck altogether. Problem in the iOS version. To transfer data between iOS, having the same iOS version is recommended. This is because the old version of iOS can have some bugs affecting the data transfer process. So the best part to fix iPhone 15 stuck on data transfer. In order to avoid data transfer issues to the new iPhone 15, reliable software like Wondershare Dr. Phone is going to be highly recommended here. This is because Wondershare Dr. Phone phone transfer tool allows you to move data between iOS devices with just one single click. In addition, it supports 8,000 plus devices, including Sony, Oppo, Samsung, Apple, and much more. Due to its wide range of compatibility with multiple devices, it becomes easier to use this tool for data transfer without any error. Besides this, you can transfer more than 12 types of data between iOS and Android devices with the help of this tool. That is why, in order to use this phone transfer tool without any error, let's go ahead and take a look at its detailed steps coming right up. Start the process by opening Wondershare Dr. Phone on your PC or MacBook and accessing the toolbox from the main interface left side tool panel. Next, choose a phone transfer and ensure that both your old and new iPhone are connected to it using an Apple certified lightning and USB-C cable. Following this, assign the, the positions to your iPhone 15 and old iOS device as source and destination. After the platform detects them successfully. Now, in case the assignment of positioning is not really correct, then just use the flip button accordingly because that way it'll just flip things around and make it appropriate. Now select the old iOS or iPhone data that you want to transfer to the new one by using the data transfer option. Afterward, OneShare Dr. Phone will ask you to disable the Find My feature. Doing this will start the data transfer process, after which you will wait for some time until the process is finally completed. And with this, today's video has finally come to an end. Apple's new iPhone 15 release has excited iOS users a lot, due to which nowadays, transferring data from an old iPhone to a new one is their primary challenge. But with today's video, we hope that now you are capable of transferring data without getting your iPhone 15 stuck in the transfer process. However, if you still face any kind of issues, do make sure to mention them in the comment section and we will do our best to get you to its solution as soon as possible. Now finally, do make sure to give this video a thumbs up and to subscribe to our channel to see new informative videos just like this one regularly. Now, until next time, have a good one.